In the middle of our busy schedules, sometimes I take a moment, look around me and wonder, why aren't we taking advantage of this great time that we are living in? Why are the people only living from paycheck to paycheck and they are not using their talents and skills? As if they are waiting for someone to bestow on them and give them the approval to flourish and use all their potential. You will hear a lot of people around you, including the media, speaking about bad economies, layoffs, tragic incidents around the world and on and on. All of these things are things that you cannot control. But do you really know what you can control? It's you. You can only control yourself, your attitude and behavior. We are living in a time where any person can achieve anything, and I mean this literally. We can access any type of information and learn about any topics while we are sitting in our places. We can start a business with almost no capital. We can reach and learn from the greatest world thought leaders at any time. And finally, the internet and technology made our lives easier by automating and solving hundreds of our day-to-day -day problems. I will not be exaggerating if I said that it's a wonderful time to be alive and use all of these opportunities. So the big question now is, are you going to use all of these advantages to your favor or you will face 2017 with the mentality of the 80s? Now, in the era of the internet and connectivity, you can do anything from any place and reach anyone around the world. Let's take an example. Let's say that you wanted to start a business of manufacturing handmade t-shirts. In the 90s, and if you have good connections and money, you will pay a lot to place an advertisement on your local TV and hope that some people in your country will see it and order from you. And if you are less fortunate and having less money and limited connections, then most probably you will print flyers and distribute them in the streets in the areas around you. Now, in the era that we are living in, you can reach 6 billion people around the globe with a little amount of money and with no connections needed. Not only this, you can deliver your product to any place in the world within few days and you can track the status of your package online. And I insisted on giving an example about t-shirts as a physical product because it requires more effort than services. If you are a talented writer, painter, video editor, you can join some platforms such as Fiverr or Upwork and offer your services to a global audience while you are sitting at home. All of these things can add value to your life and can be another stream of income while you are doing the things that you love and talented in. When I look around me, I wonder really how we neglect to use all of these opportunities and just move blind with the flow. So here's what I advise you to do. Start now. Ask yourself, what are my talents or the things that I enjoy doing? What are the things that the people around me say that I'm skilled in doing? And start finding your way on the internet. If you are a talented writer, search for online places to publish your articles or create your own blog and let the world hear your voice. If you are talented in drawing or designing, then help others who search for designers and along the way make money. If you are a video editor, then create videos and help small companies present their stories online in an inspiring way as an example. Search for opportunities to grow and to add another stream of income to you and your family. Use all the blessings that we have in this era instead of sitting, looking only at one side and worrying about the economy. We are living in a fantastic time, so all what you really need to do is to imagine what you can achieve, believe that you can achieve it, and act to make it happen. And do not forget to share this episode with your family and friends if you found it useful. Till next time.